Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. During the military exercise Freedom Shield 24, FS-24, in South Korea, which involved US and South Korean soldiers, the South Korean armed forces deployed their latest mobile air defense system, known as the K-30W Chunho. FS-24, an 11-day exercise commencing on March 4 and concluding on March 14, 2024, aimed to replicate the Korea theater of operations, encompassing a combined, joint, multi-domain, and interagency operating environment. The exercise sought to foster understanding and coordination among the Combined Forces Command, United States Forces Korea, the United Nations Command, and the ROK Joint Chiefs of Staff to enhance combined defense posture and alliance response capabilities against diverse security threats. Utilizing live, virtual, constructive, and field-based training, FS-24 engaged military personnel from various services and federal agencies, emphasizing multi-domain operations integrating land, sea, air, cyber, and space assets. Notably, service members from 12 United Nations Command member states, alongside the Neutral Nation Supervisory Commission, participated in the exercise. FS-24, conducted in accordance with the ROKUS Mutual Defense Treaty and the Armistice Agreement, underscored the enduring military partnership between the ROK and the US, showcasing the alliance's pivotal role in regional peace and security. Concurrently, ROK-led and US-led units conducted large-scale combined training sessions to bolster interoperability and combat readiness, aiming to enhance security and stability not only on the Korean Peninsula but also across Northeast Asia and the Indo-Pacific. The K-30W Chunho, dubbed Sky Tiger, represents a modern anti-aircraft gun-wheeled armored vehicle system developed by Hanwha Aerospace for the Republic of Korea Army. Designed to enhance defense against low-flying aircraft and drones, the K-30W Chunho replaces the aging 20mm M167 Vulcan Air Defense System. Mounted on the Hyundai Rotom K8088 by 8 armored vehicle chassis, the K-30W AAGV features a two-man turret, similar to the tracked K-30 Baiho self-propelled anti-aircraft gun, SPAAG. Equipped with two 30mm rainmetal air defense, Erlikon, KCB automatic cannons, manufactured under license by the South Korean SNT Group, the K-30W Chunho delivers effective defense against low-flying threats. With a cyclic rate of fire of 600 rounds per minute for each gun and an effective firing range of approximately 3 kilometers, the K-30W Chunho boasts significant firepower. The vehicle accommodates a crew of three, including a commander, gunner, and driver, with provisions for additional operators if needed, and offers protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. Developed with advanced targeting systems to enhance localized support and self-targeting capabilities, the K-30W Chunho entered service after the initial batch of AAGWs was received by the South Korean military, signifying a significant upgrade in South Korea's air defense capabilities. The collaboration between Hanwha Defense and Hyundai Rotom underscores South Korea's commitment to maintaining a robust defense posture against evolving aerial threats. That's all for now. See you later.